Hello, you are welcome to Park Maths. In this video, I'm going to solve this nice algebraic math problem, which is x plus xy plus y is equal to 64. So here we will try to find the value of x and y, where x, y are positive integers. To solve any math problem properly and step by step, first we will write solution, and then we will write the question in the solution again, and we will try to solve it step by step. So the question is x plus x times y plus y is equal to 64. Now first of all we will take x common from the left hand side from the first two terms. So taking x common it will become here only one will be left plus here only y will be left plus y is equal to 64 look into this one first term here is 1 plus y so we will try to make here 1 plus y to take it common from the left hand side now to make here 1 plus y we will add 1 to both sides of this equation so let us add 1 to both side of this equation so it will become here x times 1 plus y plus we can write it as 1 plus y is equal to 64 plus 1 is 65 now from the left hand side we will take 1 plus y common so taking 1 plus y common it will become here's only x is left Thus, here is only 1 is left is equal to 65. Right, let us rearrange these expressions and the terms in this expression. So, we can write this left hand side as x plus 1 and this can be written as y plus 1 is equal to 65. Now my dears, look into the left hand side, here is the product of two expressions, x plus 1 and y plus 1. So here we will factorize this right hand side, this number to the product of two numbers to compare this expression with the numbers in the right hand sides. So we can write 65 as 1 times 65. We can also write 65 as 5 times 13. Now there is no other factorization of 65. No, but from the left hand side here, as since x and y in this question are positive integers, so a positive integer plus 1 is always greater than or equal to 2. Similarly, y plus 1 will be always greater than or equal to 2. So it means that this expression and this expression must be greater or equal to 2. So here we cannot compare this expression with this product of numbers. So here we will reject this pair of numbers. So we will only compare this expression with this product of numbers which gives him 65. So further we can write this equation as x plus 1 times y plus 1 is equal to 65 can be written as 5 times 13. Now here we will compare this first expression with the first one number and this second expression with the second one number. Here we can also compare the first expression with the second number and the second expression with the first number. So by comparing these expressions we will get two equations. One is x plus 1 is equal to 5 and the second equation is and y plus 1 is equal to 13. So we will solve these two equations for the values of x and y. So here we will take this one to the right hand side so it will become negative 1. Now 5 minus 1 is 4 and here also we will take this one to the right hand side so it will become negative 1 and 13 minus 1 is 12. So here we get the values of x and y. 
Now here we will try to verify that x is equal to 4 and y is equal to 12 are the exact and correct values of x and y in this problem or not. So we will verify it here. Let's verify. Now to verify it, we will read the problem here. Now the problem is x plus x times y plus y is equal to 64. Now here we will substitute the values of x is equal to 4 and y is equal to 12. So it will become x is 4 plus x is 4 times y is 12 plus y is 12 is equal to 64. 4 plus 12 times 4 is 48 plus 12 is equal to 64. Now here 48 plus 12 is 60 and 60 plus 4 is 64 is equal to 64. Now since both sides are equal so it means that x is equal to and y is equal to 12 are the exact and correct values of x and y in this algebraic math problem. And last, if you like this video, so don't forget to subscribe my YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.